My name is Maria Kochetkova and I'm a principal dancer with San Francisco Ballet. Uh, it was my mom's idea for me to try ballet. I was doing uh, rhythmic gymnastics professionally and I had no interest in ballet at all. My mom took me first year to, to go through the exams and I didn't pass and I wasn't really upset about it. But the second year round I passed, I think I was one of the 50, out of the 50 girls to get in. The training at the school was really hard, but at the same time it was one of the best schools in Moscow, so I was really honored to, to get in and uh, study there. Uh, it definitely made me a dancer, um, who I am now. Um, during actually my years at the Bosch School, I did Brida Lausanne competition and um, my, my school didn't approve me for that, so I prepared myself secretly in the evenings and went uh, and did it and I won. I won um, um, the apprenticeship um, and I spent one year at the Royal Ballet and then uh, the next four years I was with English National Ballet. I saw San Francisco Ballet dance in London and I loved them, so I decided if I ever tried to move the company, that would be the company. I just um, sent my staff and I was invited for audition and Helge um, offered me a principal contract straight away. So that was kind of a magical uh, that this happened. I could not expect something like this at all. Over my years in the company, I worked with so many choreographers, but one of them was Christopher Wilden. When it was my first year and he came to choreograph his ballet, he picked me as the first cast uh, for the main part. And, you know, I, I was really, really grateful to him that he trusted me, even I had no experience in uh, doing any contemporary work. And I can imagine it was probably hard and for him. And But I'm really grateful that he gave me this opportunity and I was, and his ballets, uh, every single ballet ever since um, I joined the company. I think my favorite role is Giselle. I feel uh, the most organic with this part because it's just very close to who I am. I feel so much on stage you get to live the life and go through so many different emotions. And it's just one of his ballets, it's so beautiful and that uh, feels really close to my heart for some reason. In life usually sometimes I cannot exactly explain to people what I mean, what I want and feel like so much easier to do it by dancing. You can just speak with your body and you can express yourself. I feel myself when I dance when I have performances, when I work, and when I don't, it's, it's just like something is missing. The strangest thing is I've danced on many stages, but every time I come on stage in San Francisco, even though I've danced so many times here, I feel this nerve and like I'm scared, but in a good way. And I feel it's really, really important because once you lose that connection, um, uh, it's, you lose something special and uh, it's probably time to move on. <laughs> I feel if you truly love um, what you do and you work hard and not just hard but smart, um, then everything is possible and any dream uh, can come true. I don't know what I would do if I wasn't a dancer. <laughs> <laughs>